Welcome to Wilderstein. Those are the first words you hear when you arrive at this 19th century Victorian Queen Anne style mansion. Uh, it's a place with a lot of heart and a place where we welcome every visitor as if they were coming to our own home. At Wilderstein, visitors instantly are family. Located in the countryside of Rhinebeck, New York, Wilderstein, the home of the Sukli family for 150 years, has not always been the gem that it is today. Decades of financial strains left Wilderstein in a state of serious disrepair. When in 1991 Daisy Sukli died, the rescue of the house began. The house was badly in need of CPR. You may wonder what CPR means. Well, it refers to three processes that we use to take care of the site and all of its collections. The C stands for conservation. That is materials that we need to keep in their original state by doing things like cleaning and basic repairs and doing as little as we can to make them last as long as they can. We've conserved books and papers and objects. For example, we have a large collection of 40 or 50 oil paintings. We've conserved them. They've gone to a special uh, conservation center where professionals have worked on them. The same has happened with maps and manuscripts, uh, animal skin deeds, and uh, things of that nature. The P stands for preservation, which is another way of keeping things going. It's taking the original building and the grounds and trying to do what we can to keep the grounds from eroding and the buildings from falling down and uh, repair them in any uh, way we can. If you look at the visuals of our build, uh, main building, the mansion, you'll see that much of that has been repainted and we're um, almost at the end of preserving the building itself. And then we'll have to care for it for ever and ever. And restoration really refers to the land and to the buildings than it does to the collections. And restoration is when you have to replace things, uh, new wood, uh, new trees, work on the landscape in various and sundry ways. Replacing trees and uh, working on the landscape, new gravel, things of that nature. In 1889, Miss Margaret Sookley was born here at Wilderstein, and she lived here until 1991. It's during the period that, from 1989 to her death in 91, that many of us knew her, and how much she cared about this site, and felt that it was important to not only preserve, conserve, and restore it, but to make it available for people to come and enjoy the landscape and the various things that are in the collection as well as the building itself. It's unique in the sense that it has always been in the same family, that it has 45 rooms filled with their history, going back to members of the family from the 18th century who didn't live here, but whose uh, memorabilia and stories of their lives were uh, left here when they uh, died and uh, remained here. So it's a very special site. As you can see, Wilderstein is a very unique place. We welcome all to come and visit and enjoy a special piece of history.